In this video, we're going to talk about how to work with CSV data, the type of data that, uh, that I gave to you in this project. So to start with, you'll want to download the data from Blackboard and save it somewhere on your computer or on any lab computer or on a flash drive. These are not huge files. Uh, so once you've picked which kind of data you want to use, the easiest thing to do is to just double click on the data to open it. If that doesn't work on your computer, you might have to right click on that and go to open with or open using, whatever that is on the particular operating system you're using, and choose the spreadsheet program that you have installed. All right, once that spreadsheet program is, is up and running, um, we, can, we can do various things with the data. So one of the first things we should talk about is how to save your data. Let's make a change. I'll add the letter X here in this cell. To save your data, you're going to want to not save it as a CSV file because that won't save a lot of the information that you're wanting to keep. So the best thing to do is to go up here to File, Save As, and then from this box, you're going to want to uh, you're going to want to change the type of file so that instead of saying a comma separated values, you change that to an Excel workbook file. And you can change the name of the document if you'd like and save it wherever it's convenient for you. Now that you've saved the data in, in this new Excel format, uh, it will keep the changes that you make as long as you save before you close it. One of the first things you're going to want to do to work with this data is to add a header row. That's a column or a row up here that contains the labels for the data. So to do that, if you click on the first row and then right click and go to insert, that'll insert a blank row above the data you just had. And you can type in some headings for these columns, something like first pref, second pref, and third pref. And then save the data again. So we've covered how to open a CSV file, how to save your data, and how to add a header row.